Oh, beautiful evening at the Atwood home. Let's go take a look and see what's been done to the house. And you viewers get to come with us. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, behold the entryway and the living room. So cozy. Yeah, it's so cozy. Or as the Haldemans just told us, it looks like a very adult house with no children <laughs> <laughs> anywhere. Um, this is our living room. I'm going to sit down for a second. We just finished touring people around our house. So, um, yeah, our living room used to be covered in carpet and yellow walls and um, so forth. And it was, like, serviceable. Like, I think most of the house was... It was livable it, and nice. And... Yeah, it was livable. It just... We, it wasn't cool. It wasn't cool. And remember when we were looking for a house, we said, let's get a house with character. Yes, that was one of the, the one of the qualifications. And so we needed to give our house character. And so we pulled out carpet and found these beautiful floors underneath, except for they weren't so beautiful at the time. Um, and it used to be linoleum here in the kitchen. In order to get wood floors in, we had to pull out all the cabinets and um, put those all in the basement. And then we had someone come and put wood in and um, it's a perfect match. I guess if you use the same species of wood, you don't have to do anything special. So they just finished the wood floor for this entire floor of the house. Um, and it looks good. I think it looks good. I do too. Other things we did, new lights. Um, we had the electrician do the can lights. Um, when we put the cupboards back, we or cabinets, we didn't put quite all of them in because um, I wanted some shelves. That was my show the pots. little thing. Yeah, let me show you the pots. Um, these are our pots for quick access and plants for quick herbs. Um, what else? Countertops. I did the countertops with some help, of course, but um, we got giant slabs of cherry wood and we cut them to size and then I cut out a hole for the sink. Check out the roundedness. What kind of saw did you use? A router? No, well, I used a router to get the nice little curve edges, but no, that was a jigsaw, um, jigsaw thank you, to, to get the, that in. And then the walls back here, you'll notice, are made of brick. Don't be fooled, though. Yes, we have lights. Don't be fooled, though. The brick may look original and rustic. We added it, though, and um, painted it white. And so we added it and then screwed shelves on top of it using our leftover um, countertops. Um, and then the other cool project here... I made a spice rack because I get sick of just drawers of spices and digging through them and so these are all just jars that are have magnets on them so um, we can see all of them very easily. Blue ivy is our ivy plant and then um, some fruits and veggie pictures. And let's continue our tour downstairs. Okay when we first moved in these stairs were really steep and you would like trip on the way down because like your foot wouldn't fit on them. And so I remade them. I just got some stairs from Home Depot and put them in. No, you didn't. You built them. I built them, yes. Um, and then the other thing is I wanted a house with built-in bookshelves. And so to make that happen, we extended this wall over here. Um, it used to just go about to where the light switch was. We extended it and made some cool little shelves that I'm kind of proud of. Um, the walls in this room used to be half this thick. They used to come to about here and they would go halfway down and then it was concrete down to the floor because um, it was the foundation of the house. We just wanted simple drywall all the way down. So we reframed the wall with some help of some good friends and um, uh, did new walls in here. Um, we've got our little movie theater set up. Everyone always asks where the projector goes. It just goes right there. It shoots up, so it's a fancy one. Um, pictures on the wall are places we've been to together. And so we thought that would be a fun little theme. The laundry room, it's scary. I don't think there's anything there. 
the bedroom. This is a guest bedroom. This is uh, grandma room. the grandma room, whether it's uh, my parents or Sarah's parents, this is uh, where they stay. And they got, it's kind of cool, they got their own little bathroom here. We didn't do anything to this bathroom, but it's nice that they have it. Mm -hmm. By the way, this room was really terrifying before. Um, I'll show you a picture, but we this was our workroom for a while, where we had all the cabinets and it was like a workshop. Mm -hmm. Okay, continuing downstairs, you'll notice there's new carpet on both of these floors. And so we had that added because it was kind of a scary under the sea theme. This is the dungeon bedroom. Um, the dungeon bedroom doesn't have baseboards, doesn't have baseboards yet. We'll, we'll get them someday. Uh, it has a fun hole in the wall from when the the water main was leaking. Still have to get that fixed. And then it's we call it the dungeon bedroom because it's really deep. Like if there's a fire, I hope you're a good climber because you're going to be stuck in here. Oh, mirror. Hey, cool. Um, storage room number one is empty. Is empty. Do some serious food storage here, or for our Gentile types, you can do like a wine cellar or something. Um, and then on the right, we have storage room number two. It's a mess. Uh, we'll we'll do something about it and clean it out at some point. So there's a lot of stairs in our house because technically it's like a four-story house. Um, from the bottom to the top, it can get tiring to go up and down, but I guess that's normal, I don't know. So continuing up, we had these wood stairs put in because we thought it was so tacky to have wood on top, wood on bottom, and then like linoleum stairs. That's a, like one of the more expensive things that kind of surprised me how much that was, but I think it was worth it. So upstairs, on the right is the bathroom. Um, yeah, we like redid this pretty much. We did it the cheap way, so we kept the old tub, but we refinished it. Kept the old cabinets, but repainted them. Countertops new, mirror and lighting is new. Um, flooring is new. Uh, we really like it. We're a little terrified if it's gonna be very child friendly, but it looks cool. Hey Sarah, will you get the door? Yeah. Okay, this is the baby room. This is like Sarah put this all together and it looks really good. Um, and then real quick, because we're getting guests, this is the study. It's got like a little work area for both of us, a little couch, a little inspiration. And we'll finish in the bedroom. It's clean today, which is not uh, likely to stay that way, but we like it. It's just very simple, minimal, and there we go. Open up the champagne, pop! It's my house, come on, turn it up! Uh. Hear a knock on the door and the night begins Cause we've done this before, so you come on in. Make yourself at my home, tell me where you been. Pour yourself something cold, baby, cheers to this. Welcome to my house, baby, take control now. We can't even slow. 